Hi guys, Dan Stollers here. A very good morning to you all. I hope you're all well at home. So the 2023 annual coin set has been released this morning. We're going to talk about how to get it for a little bit cheaper and also the coins in the coin set as well. Also, there'll be no coins actually featured in this video, but we are going to probably get our hands on a set still a little bit undecided. So we'll talk about the five coins then in the coin set. We'll start off with the two pound coins, the Century of the Flying Scotsman. In my opinion, that one is probably the greatest design in the set. We move on to the life and work of J.R.R. Tolkien. We've got a nice five pound commemorative for the 75th birthday of King Charles III. Two 50p coins, the Windrush Generation, and also the 75th anniversary of the NHS again. Rather disappointing, in my opinion. Alice, I think you could have done a little bit better, but who am I to judge? And again, for a senior designer at the Royal Mint, don't think that is quite a touching tribute, as it says on the website. However, my opinion to one side, you can get these on different websites. £50 at the moment on the Royal Mint website. I see Change Checker, Westminster doing it for £42. The Coin Club, you can get it at £40. Again, you will have to pay postage on top of these as well. And again, getting it maybe change checker off the coin club. You're saving you £10 as well on the set. So that will probably be my way to go. Personally for me, I'm not 100% sure if it is worth the £40 in my opinion. If you could maybe get a full Beatrix Potter set or something in between. Perfect and circulated for the same price. Probably will get one for the channel nonetheless. And again, it would be nice to see some of these coins released for UK circulation. Usually we do get a couple of them from the annual coin set released out into the wild. My honest opinion, if it was going to be one of them, it would be the NHS coin. Again, with the Royal Mint over making £2 coins, it could be hard to see any £2 coin commemoratives being released for circulation. But I think everyone would be on my side if we had the Flying Scotsman in circulation again. Probably 0% chance of it happening, but we've got to keep our fingers crossed. And again, this would be a fan favourite. Royal Mint, if you're listening, get this one in circulation. It's an absolute beauty. It's not someone just going on Microsoft Word, writing out a few letters. Yeah, that'll do. This is a stunning design. Mr. John Bergdahl, you should be proud of that £2 coin. Let me know if you've got the coin set in the comments section below. Again, still a bit 50-50 for me. Probably will purchase it, but again, I do think that the previous years was a little bit better. Again, this is just my honest opinion on what I think of the coin sets. Everyone's opinions will be different. I'm not trying to have a go at Alice. Just think that probably that design work could have been better. Again, for an incredible NHS we have. Stay safe and as always, guys. Thanks for watching.